after having very, very decent three season shares at Marshall, this man Cameron Fancher has he has something to prove, man. He's coming to Florida Atlantic trying to show everybody that he is that guy. Look, he was running, he was passing, he was doing his thing. But now it's time to show it. This season, he plays with a great Florida Atlantic team trying to do their thing. But here today, they got to go up against UCF. What's good, everybody? It is your boy, Underdog Fly K, Clutch K, 247. And we are here with the first gameplay here on the channel of College Football 25. Man, I'm trying to give you guys some of the best content you guys can get. And I'm not going to lie to y'all, man. This is a whole different game than Madden. It may look the same, but it's a whole different game. Um, I'm out here in the nickel over. If you guys haven't seen the video, make sure you guys go ahead and check out the last video here on the channel of how you set up the blitz here in nickel over. And as you guys can see here in this game, that he was picking it up pretty well. Um, but I did do some other adjustments here in game and things of that nature, trying to find out how to, you know, how to really perfect it in the game standpoint and just seems like it just couldn't come in as he keeps dotting the defense up in the back manning up the left side and making sure i can see getting on the right side as you guys can see i finally get it to come in on that side as he gets a second and four only sending four people he loves hitting the underneath and things of that nature the man thinks that he is like that so he's just going to keep running the ball throwing it underneath hitting corner routes it's just a simple game plan then he hits the read option to get into the end zone for the first score of the game but here comes Cameron. Cameron said, look, you guys think you can do that here on offense. We going to try and give you guys this trips fly in and just really apply that pressure. So we get down here to a third and five. You guys see the play art. You guys see what we got cooking up down here. And we throw it to the tight end with a nice little catch, nice little possession to get down there. And we get a little sticky icky a little bit as we get into the second quarter now the three minute quarters i'm not gonna lie three minute quarters quarters is kind of crazy i like it as we throw a nice little dump off down here to platt as he tries to get a little sticky down there and he breaks a few tackles gets hit and you guys see it he he can he can get mobile he does he does this he gets mobile he throws it up top to the tight end once again gets down at the one yard line tries to send the whole pressure tries to run commit but we get out there for the first score here on the channel let's go man here back on defense that's the one thing i want to learn man i want to learn how to really shut down this defense and really not shut down the defense but really like learn how to be locked down with this defense even sending a little loop over here on the end too like i'm telling y'all man i found some stuff here with this nickel over and i'm letting you guys know the nickel is getting over but he throws that He's still got enough time to throw that. That is wild to me. But I mean, hey, it is what it is. And I was trying to learn how to do the uh, the switch stick in this game, but I didn't learn, I mean, I didn't know until afterwards that you cannot have your user be blitzing to switch stick. So now since I know that, now I know why it wasn't sitting here working as he gets down to a second and goal, goes to the pistol full house and gets into the end zone once again. And then he tries to get into the double A gap. Look, you cannot send double A gap versus me and Trish tight end. I know how to get through that. Uh, you just can't do that. Then he tries to go to the penny, but then wide open once again is that tight end, man. That man that man was eating. Hey, any tight end in trips fly in is going to be eaten. As we throw a nice, oh my God. Can we just can we just show appreciation to the beautiful pass before halftime? Good Lord, Fancher got that thing in there. Um, tries to get out there to the outside. Great fight to get to that first down right there. Um, tries to see if we got anything deep. We could hit R1, but he ends up getting using that mobility that he has to throw it down the field. And Ed is just, oh, let me, excuse me. Excuse me. I didn't know we can get a little sticky icky right there, man. Hold on now. But yeah, we sitting here doing our thing. Throws the ball down the field and it's caught. At this point, this man has 212 yards and really hasn't lost a completion, and he throws it into the end zone once again to a wide open wide receiver just going crazy. And right there, once again, when it seems like the blitz comes in, he finds something to go to, you know, to get that bell out. But he's just hitting underneath because that's all that's being available. The pressure is coming, get that ball out really quickly, and it just seems like it's either underneath or he's throwing it to a cross or a crosser to the outside. So with me trying to sit here and learn how to 
use this defense here in college football. That's just the things that you're going to have to um, go through. You got to have to learn through trial and error to go through the defense to see what the problem is. And right there, I switched the same blitz, but in a man form that you guys can see in the video as well. Um, with his first incompletion right here, I believe. Um, that you can do the same blitz here in man, but oh my god, another dot right there by camera. That you you gotta you gotta man people up and do certain things to make sure the defense is right as we have a huge bomb down the field to Tucker. Oh my gosh, no no no, this trip's tight end is crazy. Cameron Fletcher is just throwing the ball on the money, doing his thing, man. And I'm not going to lie to you. The Florida Atlantic offense is kind of cooking. The defense kind of cooking. This play right here, I was trying to switch uh, the uh, switch stick right there. But like I said, I, I, I know now that you cannot do it with a blitzed user. So we got to we gotta be better in the next game. And I got y'all, man. And we're going to perfect, perfect this defense even more. We're going to perfect the gameplay, perfect the... You know the audio and things of that nature but here once again he on a little guap drive tried to do switch stick again and didn't work but we got the nice little play right there as we hit a juke move right there getting up the sideline the 40 to 30 and getting down at the 35 to 25 my apologies tries to run the ball to see if i can go ahead and get down his timeouts but i was like he came out in the double mug so i said you know what let's go ahead over the top to one of our loyal loyal wide receivers and tucker gets it in the back of the end zone for a touchdown once again on that florida logo and right there finally played great defense but i run into his wide receiver so it kind of neglects that terrible user right there but he ended up not throwing it ends up throwing it away once again he has the underneath wide open he even has the playmaker up there wide open but i think in this state right here he is trying to wind down the clock as much as he can and once again the pressure comes in but he has a dot every time the pressure wants to come in he finds a laser but it seems like this whole defense like every everything was open i'm not even gonna uh, uh sugarcoat it everything was open so we're still trying to learn the defense we only al allowed what we allowed and i feel like that's a w we still did our thing here on offense he had the crosser up there wide open but i guess he didn't know that if it was manned on him or not he didn't throw it decides to run it in for a touchdown and you left me with 18 seconds left you left cameron fancher with 18 seconds left to show why he is him and trust me he's not going to disappoint play action go ahead and hold it right there he throws it underneath cuts the user gets sticky oh my god a tight end can get sticky 10 seconds left we call our timeout try to run up a play and he pass commits to get a sack so we have to burn another one seven seconds left to go i go back to all reliable play action pass and he leaves the corner down there wide open on the sideline gets it down there to the 32 yard line and then everybody's achilles heel is the field goal we ended up stopping it at the right moment gets the field goal to go and we win the game appreciate you guys for watching more content on the way and let's go ahead and hear from the man himself peace out the defense was was uh was flying around today um i feel like the offense and defense were, were battling throughout the whole day so um it was good to see it was good to see that